The short answer is yes. A machine like this can save your life, and that is what we're going to discuss on today's video. An at-home EKG machine is probably going to be in every household at some point in the future because it is so vital. There are two major concerns that I'm just going to attack right now before we get into what these things look for, and that is if you're over 50, you're over 60, you're over 70, you start having a little bit of uh, feeling in your chest, you don't feel that good, you feel a little hot, your heart is racing, you don't feel good, how do you know if you should call 911 or uh, check yourself? Well, you call 911, but these machines are good. Now, what happens, let's just do this, what happens if uh, it's a false positive? And what I mean by that is you you use a machine like this, a, a home EKG machine, and it turns out that it actually says something's wrong, but there is nothing wrong. And you went to the doctor to uh, get checked and they said, no, your machine is wrong. That's actually okay. And the reason why is because having a false positive only to find out there's nothing wrong with you is, is okay. What if it's a false negative? The great news is the technology with which they make these things, these home uh, EKG machines, you're not gonna get a false negative. If anything, you might get a inconclusive uh, reading and thus you should see a doctor anyway. You need a blood pressure machine at home, you need a thermometer at home, and you're gonna need one of these. So what do these things look for? What does a home EKG machine look for? It looks for four things, and get a pen and paper handy because I'm, I think you should write these down. Number one, it looks for an arrhythmia. And what an arrhythmia is, it's an irregular rhythm of your heart. Now this could be for a number of reasons, it could be actual damage to your heart. It could be a neurological problem with the electrical system of your heart. It could be a sign that there's something wrong that they may need to check blood. But if you find an arrhythmia on your home unit, then you really should proceed and get this further checked. Number two, atrial fibrillation. Atrial fibrillation is where the upper chambers of the heart are out of sync with the lower chambers of the heart. It's called atrial fibrillation because the upper chambers, the two chambers of the heart are called the atrium and the lower chambers are called the ventricles. And if they're out of sync with one another, then you don't have a smooth uh, pumping of blood throughout your body. You may feel this as a shortness of breath, like your heart is skipping. Think of it this way with an atrial fibrillation. It's kind of like the drummer of the band is out of sync with the bass player and the electrical guitar. They all should be on the same wavelength or in sync with one another to create harmonious music. The third thing that these home units can check is tachycardia or bradycardia. Tachycardia is where your heart is racing at a very fast rate, usually over 100 beats per minute. That could be for a number of reasons. You could have a thyroid problem, you can have an electrolyte problem, there could be an electrical problem in your body inside the heart with the AV nodes, that can be a reason why you can have tachycardia. Or you can have bradycardia, which is a super slow heart rate, something below 60. So that could be a magnesium or potassium deficiency. It can alert you to the fact that something is wrong with your heart. The fourth and final thing that these things can check for are PACs, premature atrial contractions. And again, like I said, there are upper chambers of the heart and lower chambers the upper chambers are beating too much relative to the lower, and this will disrupt your heart rhythms, and that's not good. So that's why you should have this type of machine at your house. So this company sent this to me and wants me to review it, and what we're gonna do is we're just gonna open it. It's from a company, and I've done reviews of their products before. It's from WellU. And this is their Duo EKs uh, Personal EKG Tracker. So let's just open this. We don't need that. I've used these before, so I know kind of what I'm looking at. They send nice cards with warranties, little handheld thing. Don't need that. And it comes in the box just like so. Pull it out. Usually they give you a charger. There it is. Don't need that. There's the charger. I'm going to show you how to use this. 
So the great thing about this is that you just use an app on your phone and that way it can record things and you could send PDF files to your doctor or anybody that you want. Once this thing is fully charged, there's a number of ways that you could use these. The best way, the way that I like, is just use your fingers like this, you could see, and um, it's already working, so let me just turn it off for a sec. And Or you can place it on your thigh and a finger, or your heart and a finger. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna shut up for a second and let this machine just do its job for a little while and I'll show you exactly what it what it's doing. So what we'll do here now is we will look at the, so you can now look at your phone and see the analysis here. And this time I wasn't talking and I just kind of waited for about two minutes and now I have a regular heartbeat, 68, and there's my EKG. So these devices are so good. Again, you should probably have a thermometer in your house you should have a blood pressure machine in your house. You should have your own EKG machine in your house to analyze for these things. So if you want to see, if you want to uh, get this machine, I will put a link down below in the description. You can look at this product, see if it's right for you. I would encourage you to get one. And also, if you want to know what is the best blood pressure machine, well, I'm going to have a video right here in a box and this is gonna show you which blood pressure machine are in most doctor's offices. If it's in the doctor's offices, you're gonna to wanna to get that same machine. And this will explain exactly what is the best blood pressure machine.